Today we'll begin with a new chapter called uh, Expansion Formula, chapter number 5. So now in this chapter, we are first going to learn about expansion of x plus a and x plus b. Now, the formula which we're going to learn first is this one. x plus a, x plus b is equal to x square plus a plus b x plus a b. Now, you just have to use the formula and solve the sums. So the derivation is given to you in your textbook, but basically when you solve sums, you just have to know how to use the formula and uh, derive, uh, get the answer. Okay, so now let's start with practice set 5.1, the first sum, a plus 2 and a minus 1. For the first sum to begin, first thing what we have to do is to write the formula. So come on, let's write the formula. So our formula is x plus a, x plus b is equal to x square plus a plus b x plus a b. Now let's specify what is x and what is b, a and what is b. Okay, so now this plus is not visible properly. Okay, now here this is our x, this is our x, this is our a, and this is our b. So when we solve, what we are going to do is in place of x and x we are putting a in place of a we are putting 2 and in place of b we will be putting minus 1 okay so let's begin first step is the formula Our formula is written the next thing is copy the question down so it is a plus 2 a minus 1 is equal to x square so our x is a so we write a square plus for a we are using 2 so 2 plus for b we are using minus 1 minus 1 for x we are using a a plus again for a we are using 2 multiplied by a b means a multiplied by b so 2 multiplied by for b it is minus 1 okay i hope the substitution is clear to you now after substitution uh, substituting we need to solve a square is a square plus now this is plus 2 and minus 1 so when you have plus 2 and minus 1 since the signs are different the operation is going to be subtraction so it's 2 minus 1 is 1 and sign of the greater number so it's going to be plus 1 so plus 1 a plus 2 into minus 1 plus into minus is minus 2 into 1 is 2. So basically you don't write it as 1a. So you write it as a square plus a minus 2. That's your answer. Say some number, uh, some number 2 and 3 are same. So let's take some number 4. Okay, some number 4. Now we'll do 13. That's 13 plus x 13 minus x. Okay. As I told you earlier, first thing what we have to do is we have to write the formula. So let's write the formula here. So our formula is x plus a, x plus b is equal to x square plus a plus b into x plus a b. Now after writing the formula, just mention what is a and what is b, what is x. So here we have x a x b okay now copy the sum down 13 plus x 13 minus x okay now is equal to what is our x 13 so 13 square plus what is our a x what is our b minus x okay plus minus x okay what what is our x 13 plus a into b is x into minus x okay square of 13 169 x plus x minus x is 0 so plus 0 into 13 plus into minus minus x into x x square 0 into 13 is 0. So our answer is going to be 
169 minus x squared. That's it. So now I'll do sum number 5 for you. Our sum says 3x plus 4y and 3x plus 5y. Expand this. Okay. So again, first step is the formula. So we write the formula first. So our formula is x plus a, x plus b is equal to x square plus a plus b x plus a b. Now after doing this, we have to specify what is our x and what is our a and what is our b. So x, a, x, b. That's done. Copy the question down. 3x plus 4y. 3x plus 5y is equal to x square. So that means 3x is 3x. So 3x square plus a plus b. That means 4y plus 5y into x. That means 3x plus a into b. Means again. 4y into 5y. 4y into 5y. Okay. 4y into 5y. So, a square of 3 is 9. Square of x is x square. Plus 4 plus 5 is 9y. Multiply by 3x. Plus 4 5s are 20y square. 9x square plus 9 3s are 27xy plus 20y square. I hope this is clear. This is xy because here you have x and y. Even you multiply 9 into 7, you also have to consider these uh, two variables. So now I have done sum number 5. Now we will do sum number 8 because it has a fraction in it. X plus 1 upon x, x minus 1 upon x. Now again, first step is formula. So let's write the formula. x plus a, x plus b is equal to x square plus a plus b, x plus a, b. Okay. Now what you have to do is mention what is x and what is a and what is b. So, x, a, x, b. This I'm just writing for your understanding. You don't have to write it during exams. Now, copy the question down. x plus 1 upon x. x minus 1 upon x. Okay. So, what is my x here? x is x itself. So, x square. a is 1 upon x. Plus minus 1 upon x. Okay. Into x. Now again plus 1 upon x into minus 1 upon x. Okay. So here we have x square. 1 upon x minus 1 upon x is 0 into x then plus 1 into minus 1 plus 1 into minus 1 is minus 1 x into x is x square fine 0 into anything is 0 so basically your answer is x square minus 1 upon x square okay so now let's do sum number sum number 9 sum num number 9 is 1 upon y plus 4 and 1 upon y minus 9. Okay. Again, formula first. So, our formula is x plus a, x plus b is equal to x square plus a plus b, x plus a and b into b. So, let's write first. So, this is going to be our x. E X B. Fine. Now for again 
we have the question here. Minus 9. So what is our x? 1 upon y. So 1 upon y square plus what is our a? 4 plus minus 9 into 1 upon y plus 4 into minus 9. So square of 1 is 1, square of y is y square or plus 4 minus 9. So let's do it here, minus 9 plus 4. Operation is going to be minus because the signs are different. So 9 minus 4 is 5 and sign of the greater number that is minus 5. So you have minus 5 into 1 is minus 5 upon y plus into minus minus 9 fours are 36. So this is your answer. 1 upon y square minus 5 upon y minus 36.